The OnePlus 9 and OnePlus 9 Pro continue the brand's streak of excellent phones that undercut the competition, though prices are no longer as low as they once were. Still, you get a lot for your money, and we expect that will remain true for the OnePlus 9T, which as a late 2021 handset could be a direct rival to the likes of the iPhone 13. While there aren't any leaks about the next generation of Plus One phones just yet, this doesn't mean we can't come up with a wish list of sorts, summarizing what we want to see changed in the OnePlus 9T and 9T Pro smartphones. Before we begin this video, please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to never miss our future videos. Also, do let us know which is your favorite smartphone brand and why. Comment box is open, guys. All right, guys, so let's begin. Design of the smartphone. When it comes to the design, there isn't anything inherently wrong with the OnePlus 9 Pro and T models are hardly ever changing the design over the regular device. Personally, I would have loved a bolder design, but let's face it, it's unlikely that the T model will introduce any significant design changes. Instead, what's definitely more likely are more color options available, because let's face it, the color options in which the OnePlus 9 and 9 Pro launched are quite boring and fail to excite. Hopefully, the OnePlus 9T will right that wrong. Processor of the Smartphone Provided that the OnePlus 9 Pro and OnePlus 9 comes along with the latest and greatest Snapdragon 888 chipset, it is unlikely that the next phones will come along with newer chips. Qualcomm doesn't usually announce more than a single flagship chipset per year. That and the current chip crisis doesn't really bode well for the successor of the Snapdragon 888. Surely, we'll see the next-gen Silicon sometime in December, when Qualcomm hosts its annual events, but the OnePlus 9T certainly won't come with it on deck. Camera of the Smartphone When it comes to the camera, the only mildly annoying feature that prevents the phone from being the best of the best is the lack of an ultra-long telephoto zoom camera that will bring it on par with the other Galaxy S21 Ultra, which is arguably the most advanced Android phone available right now. We would have loved OnePlus to have employed a 5X or longer, but Hopefully, this will be addressed in the upcoming OnePlus 9T. Even if a longer zoom doesn't appear this fall, it will be okay. OnePlus made more than enough camera changes recently to warrant a pass. As far as the software side of things goes, OnePlus did a good job with the tweaking of the image color reproduction thanks to the partnership with Hasselblad. Release Date of the Smartphone there's no news on when the OnePlus 9T will launch yet, but it's almost certain to be announced in either September or October since T models are always unveiled in those months in recent years. The OnePlus 8T was announced on October 14th, so it's possible the OnePlus 9T will launch at a similar time, but OnePlus isn't usually quite that consistent with its launches, so don't be surprised if it's up to a few weeks either side of that. Whenever it's announced, it will probably go on sale very soon afterwards, as OnePlus doesn't tend to wait around for that. Price of the Smartphone As for the price, there's no news there either, but the OnePlus 9 starts at $729, so the OnePlus 9T might have a similar price. We're not sure whether there will be a OnePlus 9T Pro since there wasn't an 8T Pro, but there was a OnePlus 7T Pro. But if there is, then we might be similar in price to the OnePlus 9 Pro, which starts at $969. While we're waiting for official news about the OnePlus 9T, there are a few things we're hoping to see, including the following. A longer telephoto range. The OnePlus 9 doesn't have a telephoto camera at all, and even the OnePlus 9 Pro tops out at 3.3x 
optical zoom, which isn't terrible, but it's a long way short of the 10X optical zoom offered on the Samsung Galaxy S21 Ultra, or even on the 5X on the Xiaomi Mi 11 Ultra. So for the OnePlus 9T range, we want any and all models to have the telephoto camera, and we'd love for it to offer at least 5X optical zoom. Let us know if you want OnePlus to add it in the upcoming flagship. Bigger Battery One area where spending more doesn't necessarily lead to improvements is battery life, and that's definitely true of the OnePlus 9 range. While both phones should last a day, their life is fairly middling, so for the OnePlus 9T range, we want to see improvements. One change that should be easy to make is putting a bigger battery in the phone. Since a 4500 mAh, the one in the OnePlus 9 range isn't huge, but one way or another, we hope OnePlus works on the 9T's longevity. Micro SD Slot the OnePlus 9 range includes a decent amount of storage. With a choice of 128GB or 256GB, but with no micro SD card slot, that's all you get. This isn't a premium feature. In fact, as with headphone ports, it's more often premium phones that lack this than cheap ones. So, we'd really like to see it make a return for the OnePlus 9T. Or failing that, we'd settle for even more storage being built in, but only if that doesn't push the price up too much. All models should be water resistant. In recent years, OnePlus has started offering a IP68 rating on its Pro handsets, which is a level of waterproofing that's in line with other high-end phones like the Samsung Galaxy S21 range, but the standard models still lack this. So, we want OnePlus to offer IP68 rating in every model that is released. Now, tell me all you guys, what do you want to see in this beast? Tell me in the comment section. I would love to hear. So guys, this was all we knew or we wanted to see in the OnePlus 9T device. I hope you liked the video. If you really did, then smash the like button. And don't forget to subscribe to our gadgets-friendly channel, Gadgets Times.